afternoon and welcome to this beautiful contest today between the Plymouth Bobcat, Lady Bobcats, and the Interlakes Moultonboro combination team, the Lake Panthers, in this wonderful Friday afternoon concert. This is um, Paul Ferentz. I'm with Todd Austin. And we're going to bring you, I hope, uh, a winning game from the Plymouth Panthers. That would be Plymouth, who just beat Plymouth Kent Bobcats. State. Yeah. Plymouth Bobcats. Plymouth Panthers did win. They beat a, a good team. Keen beat them up good. They could be in a championship uh, game, which is always nice. We had a starting team out there. Avery Noyes is in the goal. And we got Chloe Bouchard, who's very tough. A lot of good uh, senior leadership on this team, Todd. Upperclassmen. The freshmen are bold, but they have some good leadership. Anna Aprilliano and uh, Chloe Bouchard. Yeah, Laurel Mason, 22. She's a captain. She's a senior. Uh, Megan Mativier, number 18. Audrey uh, Fields, senior. Yeah, we're about to get underway here in the lakes. Uh, Moultonboro comes in there three and three. Paul Plymouth is zero and five, but they've been improving and playing playing good as yeah, of late. They're scoring more, and they're gonna be they're gonna be all right. All right, looks like uh, is that Claire taking the draw here? Yep, we've seen her do that very well. Actually, it's number twenty twenty five. Claire, yeah. So Mo Interlakes gets possession. That's number eight. Katie Valley, the junior, oh, on a quick goal. Runs right in. The clock didn't even move. They're going to start the clock? That shouldn't count. They didn't start the clock. Oh, my goodness. All right, well, it's uh, Can't count it. The clock wasn't running. 1-0. <laughs> it's a duo. All right, we've got to get somebody on the table, figure that one out. A lot of scoring in these games, obviously. I don't know what's up with the scoreboard. <laughs> the clock is not started. <laughs> I hope they're keeping it on the field at least. Figure out what's going on. Here we go. Now it's ticking. All right, well, we're back at it. 1-0 Interlakes. 24 minutes to go still. Oh, nice wind on the draw there by number eight again. Great pickup. Kate Valley, midfielder, right inside the eight-meter mark again. Oh, number eight. Throws it in. Katie Valley again with the second goal of the day. She's obviously a leader on this team. Just a junior, yep. midfielder. She's a junior. And there's going to be another point up on the scoreboard. Plymouth down. Within the first minute, two zip. All right, we got to win this draw, and then we'll um, go from there. We've done a few of these games, Paul. We always talk about possession, how important it is, and that is key. The first two go to Interlakes, and they got two goals off it. No, you're key. You're right. All right, freshman Claire Eccleston. We'll see if she can get uh, possession of this one. Last game, I think she had six assists. Which is fabulous when you have a teammate looking for you. Again with this. Ooh. Number eight, easy possession. Katie yeah. Valley. Got a little aggressive there on that check. Number eight, Katie. Two goals and two draw wins. Three draw wins. Looking to score again. I think we're going to see a lot of number eight today, Paul. She looks like she's a pretty good player for Interleaks. Looks comfortable. Oh, pass goes a little high. Should be possession Bobcats on that pass. All right, let's work a little magic. Keep possession. And get a shot on goal. Juno Sargent bring that ball in, number 14. Lose possession already to Kate Valley. 
Got two goals and looking for a third and uh, gets it. Nice lefty, already a hat trick for number eight. My goodness, what a start. <laughs> All right, Plymouth's gonna call a timeout, see if they can uh, get Regroup. going here. Um, we're gonna take a quick break during this timeout. We'll be back in a few minutes. I gotta check the score too. The clock was not running when they scored that. We should take that goal away. Can't argue though. All right, Todd, let's do a, a restart here, redo. Claire Eccleson has yet to win a draw. And as you said earlier, possession is key to this game. And Kate Valley will attest to that. With three shots on goal and three scores already. Plymouth in the hole, three zip. 23 minutes left in this first half. Yeah, we called the time out there. We'll see uh, Coach Barb Kilfoyle if she got some, uh, made some adjustments. Trying to get the ball down in our offensive end here. Anja Barrick waiting for it, number 11. All right, Claire, let's get this it. This could be one we win. We got the call. It is our possession. All right, over to Aperliano. And we're in the offensive zone. Let's see what we can do here, Paul. Very good to see Anna with the ball. Very smart with it. Good leader. It's Laurel Mason now with possession of the ball here. Over to Anna again. Another veteran. Oh, nice, nice pass, pass in the low. middle. Oh, Claire just couldn't handle it. But picked up there by Laurel. Keep in possession. Another good pass in there. Somebody kick it in. Still on the ground. Plymouth maintains possession. a battle down there, real scrub. All right, Claire. Picks the, up the loose ball over to Brunt. Another freshman for the Bobcats. Yeah, Brunt very aggressive on defense. We're gonna whistle, it's gonna be possession interlakes. Here we go. Not a bad attempt down there. No goal. Ball's on the ground. Look, gotta get that loose ball. Juno Sargent, number 14. Couldn't pick it up. <laughs> number two. Man, she looks fast. Julia Mara. Yep, she got wheels. Oh, we're going the other way. Don't know where the call was. Prigliano. Looks like Anna's going to run it up. They put the stick right in front of her face. I guess that's okay, huh? I guess. What the heck? <laughs> Lillian Jankerson, just a freshman, number five, looking for an opening. This young t freshman team is going to be something. Give them a year or two. Nice pass in the middle. Intercepted by guess who? Number eight. Oh, Claire was chasing her down there. <clears throat> and Lake Maya, Burrow wasted no time. Oh. Got the banged up there. Penalty on that one. Maya was playing good D there. Maya Winkstead just ran into her a little too forcefully. Number two, keeping it, looking for something. Nice Lost team. possession. Oh, looks like she maybe got in the crease, Paul. It's going to be the goalie with the possession. It's Avery Noyes. Sophomore stepped up to fill a position for us this year. Bad pass right to number eight. The most dangerous kid on the field right now. Plymouth trying to play some D. Get the ball back. Nice pass oh, in the middle. Up to number eight again. And a good quick release. Katie Valley. Katie Valley four, Plymouth zero. 
Well, that, that uh, last five minutes ball, we did play a little better. We got the ball down, and I think it's going to be a long day with Katie Valley, number eight from Interlakes. On She's the, off to a uh, great start. start, and they have a, I don't know their record. I think they got about four or five wins under their belt. I think uh, I looked, it was three and three. Not bad. Yeah. They score some goals. Well, they're going to put Chloe Bouchard up for the draw here, Paul. We've seen her be successful. She's a junior, yeah, In the good past. Player. Got Maggie Roper in. Tiger Roper, I like to call her. Tough as they come. A little body contact there, but no call. Laurel Mason picks up the loose ball. Good job, Laurel. Take it, Laurel. Oh. Get a call in the 8 meter. Or, yeah, we're going to get a one of these freebies here from the 8 meter. Laurel Mason, the senior captain. Let's get one on the board here. Oh, nice shot. Nice save. Oh, Anya Barrett scoop. tried to scoop it. Lily Jenkinson's there to get the loose <clears throat> ball. Back to Anya Barrett. Be impatient. Be impatient. Possession's key. Anya looking around. Looking for the right cutter. Oh, my oh, goodness. Guess who there? gets it again? Yeah. This kid is on fire today. Nice pass. Number two, the other speed merchant on this team. Picks it up and heading right for the goal. As Maya Wingstead, she's been playing good defense for the Bobcats, Paul. Well, slowed up number two, thank goodness. Loose ball. We're going to come up with that. Oh. Okay. Going to be possession interlakes here. It can't be one of those eight meter things. No. Nope. All right. Approaching the 17 minute mark. Plumas had a couple attempts. Oh, not passes gotten on the high. board yet. It should be possession Bobcats. <clears throat> yes, it is. Okay, here we go then. So the boys lacrosse is, uh, they're also playing interlakes down there today, Paul. They're up 3 0 right now. They're having a good start this year. Yeah. Boys are playing very well. Undefeated out of the gate. We'll be live next Friday with um, Campbell. And Plymouth should be a good game. Both both teams are probably going to be undefeated coming into that contest. Yeah, Campbell is a powerhouse down south. They'll be in the playoffs for sure, fighting for a championship. Hopkinson's another one, I think. Yeah, that'll be a great contest next week. Anna Prilliano setting her team up. Maggie Roper's in there. El Means. Ellie, number 20. Coach is trying to find a combination oh, here. Oh, nice what a shot. shot. Anna Perliano. Right One on step it. and fired it. Makes it 4-1 in the lakes. Under her left arm. And we're on the board at the 16 and a half minute mark. 4-1. to one. Good job, Anna. That's so what you need a senior to step up, get him on the board. Captain. Katie Valley, 4. Plymouth, 1. See if Chloe could win another. Uh... Oh no, Chloe's not in there. Yeah, she's in there. Is that Chloe on the draw? All right, let's win another one, Chloe. Yeah, Chloe Bouchard taking the draw against Katie Velli, who is obviously looking for an All-State mention. I think she's probably going to get one. <laughs> she's having a great start today. Looks like a real leader on her team. She's fast. Oop, there's a hit. A little too high, apparently. Going to be another freebie from out there. Throws oh, it behind the net. a little no high. Good. All right. There's a break for Plymouth. A little error by the Lakers here. On this possession, might be able to cut this lead in half. Here comes it's Maggie Roper. Roper. Up to Barrick. Can't handle it. Oh, oh, oh. Ran well, into her. Not much contact there. That's Megan Mativia, senior. 
plays an aggressive game. Eliana, Marshan, Korea. Sun's going down. Might be a little chilly in a minute. And it's a lot warmer than the last time we were together, Paul. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's number three, Eliana Marshan, Korea. Senior midfielder. Makes it... 5-1 Interlakes, 15 minutes to go in the first half. Well, Plymouth has got one on the board. Let's generate a little more offense right now. Win the draw, keep possession, and get off a good shot. I want to take a number eight, giving her a rest. It's a break for us. Kids a scoring machine. Oh. Number three, though. She's got the other goal. She took the draw. Still bouncing on the ground. Senior picking up the slack. Picked up at number six, Elsie Stewart. Oh, Elise Stewart, sorry. Wasting time there. Going right after it. Somebody else got to take charge with number eight on the bench. Roper playing great defense there. Megan Materia stepping up to help. Good job, Meg. Push a little too hard, I think. <clears throat> Meg is very aggressive today. Yeah, she's fast too. Showing a lot of leader leadership for the Freshman and sophomores. <clears throat> she's a senior. She plays six sports for us here at Plymouth High School. I know. Paul. I know amazing kid. She's going to run a big company someday. She's an amazing kid. Wonderful student athlete. Senior class president. Great role model for anybody go, in the building. Number six, Elise Stewart with the ball here. And behind the net, there's Maya Wingstead. Sticking with her. Yeah, she's. Ball gets jarred loose. All right. Is that Chloe picks it up? Oh, up to Ellie Means. Pick it up, Ellie. There you go. Got to get up in the offense. We've got Means. That was Juno Sargent on the defensive end, number 14. That's Brooke Austin trying to chase that loose ball down. Not her best pass. Ellie. Here oh, we go. Nice here we go. Bond. Get a shot off. Tries to Ooh, bounce one in. Just wide. Goes out of bounds, but <clears throat> Plymouth will keep possession. Ellie Means and Apriliano. Oh, nice pass. Right oh. there in front. All right, Anna picks it up. Laurel Loose ball. Mason. Shoots. Scores. Anna Apriliano, number two on the day. Makes it 5 2 interlakes with 13 minutes to go, Paul. Great leadership right there from the senior captain. Showing the way, taking charge when you have to. Keeping us in the game. Team scoring bunches. 5-2 is nothing to overcome. On well, this break, I uh, see number eight coming back on the field here, Paul. Yeah, I missed her. We need her back. <laughs> we need her back. She's fun to watch. Good player. I think Mackie Welch is warming up on the sideline. Mackie coming in and goes ready. ropes. Tiger Roper taking it right to the All rack. the way down. Oh, it bounces one scores. in. Good job, Maggie. Way to go, Tiger. freshman. She is a Tiger. Makes it 5-3, Paul. We got a new game going here. Very aggressive. Plays with a lot of confidence. Does not back down. That's a great goal. These young kids are going to build a good team together. It's going to be fun to watch them the next couple of years. And you're right, we are in the ball game, 5-3 right now. Let's get another draw. <clears throat> I 
Fighting for it, number eight. She's tough to beat. Maintains possession and taking it right to the eight meter mark. Great control. Great stick control by number eight. Good defense there by the Bobcats though. Yep. Chloe, down there, nope. Oh man, Megan again. Megan's aggressive, she's going for that loose ball. Yeah, that I'm all for, I'm all for it. I'm all for it. Did that go in? Nope, it's on off the side. Maya Winks said there to scoop it up. Oh Maya. Number two staying right with her. She's fast. I don't know what the call was. It's pointing in the Plymouth direction, though. That's a good thing. And here we go. Over to Megan. Mativia, she usually runs it up. She's one of the fastest kids on the field, I'm no, sure. No doubt about it. Up to Mason. Job Laurel, scoop it up. Here we go. Down to 11 minute mark. Oh, nice pass. What a pass. pass. Oh, Claire just misses wide left. What a oh, great pass. That was such a great pass. Claire's rubbing her head. She's, she's a little mad at herself for missing that one, but it was a great, great job, Bobcats. It was a heck still of a, have possession. Heck of a catch by Claire. And just wide of the net on that attempt. There's Mackie Welch. Mackie's in, the game. in now. Over to Aubrey Brunt. Aubrey gets a shot off. Nice save. Laurel still Laurel fighting, fighting for the ball. For Good job, Laurel. Plymouth is stepping up their game right now. Back to Roper. Look like they're a little more settled. Roper to Eccleston. She loses. Oh, White. Not sure what happened, but I think we Plymouth still has the ball, Paul. Yeah, somewhere. All right, Claire Ooh, gets one of those. Come on, Claire, make it count. Oh, nice D there by, of course, number eight. She <laughs> She's all over the field here, Paul. She is a uh, oh, long pass. Mativia breaks it up. Yeah. Nice hustle. Oh. Number 16, Lola Ferranti running it down. She's just a freshman. Lola still has it. Good hit by Claire. A little too strenuous, apparently. Lola working it again. Claire, Good back defense. on B. Good job. Dislodges the ball, catches it, and takes off. Timeout White. Got a timeout right now. Scores 5-3. Got just under uh, 10 minutes to play, and we'll be right back. All right, Ty, we're hoping uh, Coach Kilfoyle is working our magic. These guys know they're in the game. On well, the last time out, they uh, made some adjustments. We've been playing pretty good. Plymouth has since since then. Maybe uh, get a breather. They've been hustling pretty good on defense, trying to slow down number eight, Katie Velli. <laughs> I know. The only way you slow her down is get the coach to put her on the bench. <laughs> Up to Means. Come on, L. Chase Pick it, it up, down. L. There you go. Good play. Trying God. to get it to a Perliano. No good. Passed a little high. Possession. Number 16. Lola Ferrente, just a freshman. Taken in. Good D there. But Tibbs a little too much. Inner legs. Moulton Burrow still with the ball. Oh, passes it in. Number one, nice save, Avery. Blocked it, good. Good block. They get it back, though. So Avery Noyes, first year goalie, Paul. She she stepped up, filled yeah, the hole for the Bobcats. She's doing a great job. What? Well, we got a whistle before the shot. Julia right. Mara, junior, attack number two. Gets a free look here. Maya Winks is going to get in there and break it up. 
Oh, good job, number two. She put it right over Avery. Yeah, it wasn't a hard shot either. Just a little Julia softy Mara. over the shoulder. Junior attack. Makes it 6-3 now. Eight minutes on the clock. And Plymouth looking to get back on the threatening side of things on the attack. <clears throat> Chloe stepping out. Claire's stepping in. Claire's going to take the draw. on the draw. Here we go. 6-3. Lakers, 8-14 to go here. First half. All right. No nope. fight, no. Nope. Number eight. She's uh, good on those ground balls. We haven't had a lot of luck on the draws. Ooh, ooh. Meg playing good D. Perliano good finds steal. a loose ball. Gets it up to Welch. Nice job, Mackey. Come on, Mac. Move it. Run it up. Gets it over to Roper. Runs it over to Tiger Roper. Here we, we go, know Roper. where she's going with it. Nice pass down to Mason. Mason shoots. Oh, just wide left. Aubrey Brunt's there to chase down the loose ball. We get, uh, Plymouth will keep possession, Paul. That was a good attempt right that there. That was good. Fast break attempt. Who we got here? Brunt bringing it in. Gets it over to Captain Aproliano. Eccleston. Being patient. For the means. Back to Brunt. Laurel Mason here with the ball. Looking for looking for a cutter. Laurel's being patient. She's circling the net over to Welch. Mackie's got to get on this left side. She's a lefty. Here she comes. She's Cut right in there around. and throw it in there. All right, gets it over to Claire Eccleston. Back to Roper. Roper's going to look to shoot. Nope. We have to get a shot off. To a Perliano. Can't turn it over here. Nice move. Good shot, Anna. Ooh. Back behind to Ellie Means now. Got to get a shot off here, Paul. You got to get a payout. It's got to pay off if you're going to have this possession. Be this patient. So Welch back to Roper. I know Ropes will take it right in there. Right in front. Oh, Claire was trying to pass it back to Roper in the front, but the goalie was there. Goalie. What a catch by number eight, and there she goes. Haley Doda. Up to number eight, Katie Velli. Nice D. They're playing her tough, Paul. Good job. Get the ball. <laughs> Fans know what's going on. It's just... Uh, Our defense is playing good today, Ference. Elsie Stewart looking for that opening. There's some D right there. It's off. Eccleson's going to get lakes. it. All right. Plymouth possession. Here we go. 4.58 to go here in the first. 6-3 Interlakes. Up to Maya Wingstead. Give her a little help. Coach is encouraging her to get downfield. Can't turn it over here. Let's go, Plymouth. How did we lose that? What happened? Well, it's going to find this hard to believe, but Katie Velli was there to intercept the pass ball. Jeez. She's having a career day. What a leader. <clears throat> Fires it wide. It's going to be possession Plymouth. But that's a rare miss for Katie. 
Juno Sargent with the ball. Juno's just a freshman as well. Let's get it out of here, Plymouth. Look for offense. Pass to no one. L comes up. Oh, what nice. a great scoop. scoop it. Outruns the defense up to Laurel Takes Mason. Off. Here we go into Aubrey Brunt. Can't handle it. Got that loose ball, though. Nice. Get back there before nice the dodge. defense shows up. Take it a little underhand. Oh, oh, what a nice, nice attempt. Scoop. All right, Plymouth will have possession here, Paul. Laurel was closest to the ball when it went out. That was a great attempt by uh, Brunt. This Laurel Mason turns. Oh, nice save by the goalie. Picked up by Claire Eccleston. Back to Aubrey Brunt. Kenzie Welch is back there. You go, Aubrey. A oh, shot. shot. Goalie's there to make a save. Yeah, that's a good block by the goalie. Mackey with a good steal. Kenzie Welch scoops up the ground ball. Oh, oh a little, a little uh, careless down there. We lose it. Fighting to get it back. Guess who has it now? This number eight. Kitty, number eight right here. Just a junior. Long pass. Hannah Pratt, number 13, with it. Taking their time. There's a nice, it's a nice turnover. Mackie Welch. Welch is there. Up to Brunt. Nice, nice pass. pass. Here we go, Keep Aubrey. going, Aubrey. Get right to the hole. Bring it right to the net. She's oh, look at the, the shoot. handle. Loses the handle though. I love Anya the Barrick. She has the right attitude. Looking to score. Every oh, Anya, time. nice shot. Oh, what eight, happened? Another penalty here. Eight meter mark, maybe. Another freebie. Minute Oops. thirty-eight to the half. Down three. Possession. Looking to score right here. Anya Barrick. I need steps and shoots uh, right in the goalie's net. This goalie's having a good day, too. Yeah, she's made a few good saves. Stopped a couple of tough ones. We get the ball back. There Barrett he is, Anya Barrick. Test her again. Oh. Looked like she was trying to pass that one. Yeah. It, a little yeah. high, though. Is Izzy Rosner in the game playing D? Number two has some pretty good uh, wheels there. Yeah, Ferris. she's fast. Here's a good Pass one. goes high. Picked up by Claire Eccleston. Claire's looking to clear it into the offensive zone here. Job, Claire. Up to Brooke. Nice catch. Here goes there Austin go. right down the middle. Number four. Going right towards the goal. All right. Going to set up the offense, apparently. Little pass in the middle. Into Welch. Number three with the pickup, the loose ball. 30 seconds here in the first half, Paul. Oh, good job by Claire Eccleston. Nice check on the stick there, able to pick up that loose ball. What a great steal. Brooke Austin trying to manage. Over to Mason, we got 20 seconds on the clock. Got a penalty call. I thought I heard somebody calling for a timeout, but I guess not. Laurel Mason's going to have the uh, eight-meter shot here. 6-3 with 20 seconds to go. A goal here would be would tremendous for the Bobcats ball going into halftime. I would love it. Be very helpful. But their goalie is standing tall today. Get it in there. Oh, man, nice low shot. Does it look that easy? They're quick, quick goalie, quick hands. Yeah, she's that been is tough. Haley Dota. That's the coach's daughter. One would assume they have the same last name. <laughs> Could be her sister. <laughs> Maybe a niece. Oh, and that's the half ball. 6-3 Interlakes. After a fast start by Interlakes, they get up 3-0. The Bobcats um, have kept pace 3-3 since then. We had some brilliance and, uh, out they're there. They're playing great defense. If it wasn't for number eight... We'd be ahead in the game. 
Yeah, or, uh, or close. No, she's got. Yeah, she's got four goals. Four goals. Yeah, we'll see what adjustments the Bobcats can make here at half. We're going to take a break, and we'll be back with the second half. All right, welcome back here for the second half. We've got Inner Lake six, Bobcats three. Been a after the first two minutes, Paul. It's been an even game. Yeah, they played well. Spurts. They're going in spurts, but I, I think the key is what you said first thing, possession. And we have not won uh, enough draws. And number eight comes up with every loose ball. And it's been a, it's tough when you don't have the shots. Yeah, we did have a few shots. Anna Perliano with two goals and uh, not Colin Roper. It's Maggie Roper with one goal for the Bobcats. See what we can do here going the other direction. The goalie for Inner Lakes, the Lakers, is playing very well today, too. She had a couple of good stops. But, yeah, um, she's only a sophomore, Paul, so she'll be around for a little while. Yep. Yeah. It's Katie Velli, number eight. Yeah, she's, to, she's been the difference. I don't know if you bother double teaming a kid like that uh -huh. or denying them the ball every we've, chance you get. We've been we've been putting an extra body on her. I don't know Brooks running down the other end of the field here. She knows where she's going. That's a good thing. She does. Oh, we Belly put a, is on the draw now. I guess put an extra defense defenseman down there. Oh, here we go. Number eight. Gets the draw again. Brooke's going to try to defend her. Steps in. Anna slides to help. Good job, Anna. Good defense. Stay with her. Looks like you're right. They are going to double her. Brooke and Anna. The whole team revolves around her offense. Good, is he? Nice slide. Is he stepped over? And to pass over to number two. She's got some speed, Paul. We'll yeah, see what tough. happens. You put she too much uh, attention to one person, there's going to be somebody open somewhere. It's a missed pass right in front of the goal. And a big everybody down there. <laughs> All right, whistle blows. It's going to be possession interlakes by the looks. They're telling Megan to. Nope, Izzy Rosner, maybe something happened. <clears throat> I think you're allowed to kick the ball, no? I think you can, yeah. You can kick it. You can sweep it in. A little broom ball, field hockey type action. All right, number eight with the ball again. Katie Valley going to play tough defense on her. She's going to try. Oh, Great oh, stick control. It. She hardly ever loses that oh, ball. Oh, number three, nice save, Avery Noise. Good job. Let's get the clear. Team is loving that. That's yeah, it. Getting excited. Oh, out to Izzy. Izzy passes it up to Claire Eccleston. These clears are important. Got to get up to the offensive end. Claire, just a freshman, does a great job. Trying. It's out off Interlake, so we'll have possession there. Sun's going down. A lot of shadow on the field right now. It's going to get chilly. Mackie Welch over here calling for the ball. Up to right Anya, Anya Barrick to a shot. Oh, the goalie's there. Makes the catch. I like the attempt. You got to take it. Oh, look at that. Right up to number eight. They know where she is all the time. Maddie Colby, junior number 11. It's Maya Wingstead and Chloe Bouchard playing defense. You gotta say, Paul, I've seen a lot of games these for these girls, and this is the best defense I've seen them play. That's good. That's good. Well, I suspect they'll only get better. They have a great uh, coaching team over there, Kerry Crow and uh, Barb Kilfoyle. So they're gonna get better. They're a young team. They're yeah, smart kids, go, good student eight. athletes. Katie Valley. Oh, what nice a great save. stop! Good job, Avery. Way to go. Gets it out to Rosner. That's a big stop. That is a Don't big stop. It. I don't know who that pass was to. But uh, Lakers have it now. Let's get it back. Linda well, Lakes was playing good defense on Izzy down there in that, on that end. Yeah, but it's key. Like you said, you got to clear it. I clear it. Mackie watches all by herself over here. I know. I Throw know it over Izzy there. Caesar. Yes, she does. Got to come down with that. Pick it up, Mackie. I don't, oh. We'll get the call. Mackie's got it. 
Prilliano's right there. Good move by Mackey. Give it to the senior captain. Nice. Senior captain. Yeah, great leadership. Up to Anya Barrick. And he's a sophomore into Aubrey Brunt. Oh, my goodness. Possession thing is so tough. Oh, there's a kick. But Anya's there. Anya loves working in the sun, working on her tan. <laughs> oh, the welch. Here goes Mackey. Get on the left side, Mackey. You no, know, Mackey, she's got to get on that side. Hook it around. <laughs> Throw it off the ground. Hoop around out to Eccleston. Good idea. Nice pick. Laurel Aprilliano. The senior leaders right there. We're going right. to get one of those eight meter. No, a little no, right deeper, there. but I think we can we can step in and shoot from there too, Paul. I would love it. That's what Anna Prilliano did. Yeah, there it is. Oh, another save. Oh. We get it back? Yeah, we got it. Aubrey Brunt's there. So for those that don't know, if it's a shot, the person closest to the line will get possession. So that was a shot. Aubrey Brunt was closest. Therefore, Bobcat possession. Brooke, nice pass, pass to Claire. Good job. Claire Eccleston with a goal. Nice pass from Brooke Austin. Sophomore to freshman. What a combo right there. That's the way to liven it up. Six to four. 20 minutes left in this game. We have got a contest going on now. That was a good pass. Good shot. Claire good. Eccleston. Yep, that good stop down here on this end. Two by Avery. And then you get the offensive end. You get yourself a good a good goal. Confidence has to increase. El Means is coming in. Mackey's out. Let's get possession now. Another draw right here. Claire Eck and number eight gets it again. Katie Velli is so good. Right to the rack. Loses possession. That's a rare moment. Claire picks it up. Comes out of the pack. Up to Means. El Means coming down, working the sideline. Oh, she loses the handle. She's there, scoop through it. There you go. Back to Barrick. Or to Aprilliano now. And is going to slow it down. Up to Claire Eccleston. Nice pass and catch there. It's getting exciting here, Paul. 6-4 Lakers. 19 to go here in the second half. Let's just get, take a shot, Anna. Take a shot. Oh, that's in. Anna Prilliano with a hat trick. Number three on the day. Makes it 6-5. Senior captain showing the way. Good job, Anna. Excellent. Bringing her All team right. back. Second half here. We're looking good here out of the gate, Paul. Two goals and uh, we're shutting them out right now. Haven't scored this half. We've got a deep bench with uh, coaches that are putting uh, fresh legs in. Yeah. Aaron Lakes with only three subs. They may be getting worn down a little. Guys are looking for each other. That pass from Brooke over to Eccleson was just fantastic. Great timing. Let's get the draw. Get number eight again. This kid is so tough to stop. Long pass. Lakers maintain possession still. Being a little patient down there, looking around. Elsie Stewart, number six, setting up the offense. Looking for the cutters. Be impatient. <clears throat> Nobody's bothering oh, her. Oh, number eight. Cut in. I don't think it went in. Oh, Is that it a did goal? go in. They did call it a goal. I don't know. It was a high bounce. I don't know. I didn't see it go in, Paul, but maybe it did. They're calling it good, so I assume they they could see it better than us. You can't let number eight get the ball. That's her fifth goal. Can't let her get the ball. Seven all to right, five. so seven five. That's all right. <clears throat> We've got our work cut out for us. I think we're playing with a lot of confidence, but that possession part is just key. That high bounce. It must have got right up under the uh, crossbar there. Yeah, I didn't know how she saw that. Oh, 
All right, Chloe Bouchard here. She's pretty good on these draws. She's met a uh, tough uh, opponent here, in Katie Velli, but you have faith in Chloe. Up to Roper. No. Nope. Oh, black possession. <laughs> All right. All right. Here we go. Play D. Play D. Slide. Slide, Matt. Oh, nice what save. A great block. Good job, Avery. <coughs> All right. Anya Barrick with a loose ball. She's got good speed, Paul. She sees Ellie. Good move. Here we go. All right. Bring it up, Al. Bobcats are on the move. Up to Laurel Mason. Senior captain scoops up the loose ball. Taking She's it got right some in. space. Nice shot. Yes. Laurel Mason gets on the board. It's at 7-6. 7 17-55 mark. Plymouth is warming up. Good job. It started with that clear. Anya Barrick tracked down that loose ball. They got it up into the offensive zone. Great shot by Laurel Mason. I think our best bets are on the fast breaks and going to be a little timeout here. All right. And we're going to take a little break and we'll be back. All right. Here we are. We're back at 7 6 Interlake, 17 55 to go. This Interlake's is... called the timeout. Bobcat's got some momentum here, Paul. It's getting exciting. I yeah. like when we have our fast breaks. It seems when things are wide open. And again, we're uh, fighting, picking up possession a little more. Number eight did just score a goal for them, but we came right back with Laurel Mason right down the pipes and threw it through her. Seven, six, 17 minutes, 55 seconds. Let's see if we can get a draw today. Here we go, Chloe. Chloe's fighting for it. This number eight is number unstoppable. Eight, man. What a day. She is as good as it comes. Look at this. She just won. I just oh. wanted that goal. Number eight, Katie Velli. That's what Makes the, it eight six. I think that's what the coach told her to do it. Yeah, get the ball that and go to the net. Give it to Katie. Katie, you know what to do. She has a great ability to pick up those loose balls, Paul. Yeah, she's been uh It's like she's got glue in her stick. We gotta she, check that thing. She's a leader. <laughs> She's the leader of possession right now. Uh, yeah, they do check the sticks. I'm, I'm, I'm joking, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> she's just that good. Yeah, she's having a good. All day. right, let's try it again. Two point game. Eight six Lakers. Seventeen minutes to go. Bouchard again taking the draw, gets it up. Ropes trying to get Perliano. over there. You got to hustle, Anna. Pick it up. Oh. We got it. White possession. Here we go. Anna over to Austin. Go. Take it right there, Brooke. There go, Brooke. Oh, she loses the handle on it. Penalty or something on the Lakers. Plymouth possession. Brooke's got it. Shoot it right there. Run in and shoot it. And, oh, goes high, though. They did call it a shot. And uh, who's that? Laurel Mason's there for the Bobcats. Goes Take it in, Laurel. Laurel. Laurel going right, right for the there. net. Nice shot. A little high again. Gone. Jenkerson's there to keep possession. I like, I, I like the attitude. Take it right in. Force the action. Lillian, nice pass into Barrick. Oh. But uh, Interlakes comes up with it. Scooped it up. That's number three, Eliana Marshan Correa. Yeah, with she's it. been in the mix all day. Uh, Tough like defender. They get it up <coughs> to number eight. Here she goes. Katie Velli. Running right by everybody. Yeah, D Holding on up, to it. D stepping up. Holding on to it. You got Anna Perliano this half is marked right up on number eight, Katie Velli. Take your time, Elise. Elise Stewart. Getting a little encouragement from her dad in the audience. Yeah, take your time. It's good advice right now. But the pass goes awry. Gets that, it up to Ellie Means. Ellie, here's your fast break. Up to Liliana. That was good defense down there. That's how we got that. That's how we got that back. That was good defense. Go to the net. All right, good job, good job. Take your time now. All right, 15 minutes here, two-point game. Oh, nice pass. Oh, that looked good, Paul, but uh, know, right was there. that Anya Barrick just missed? Right the, there. 
Just missed a net. Oh, I didn't get that call. Not sure either, but it's going to be Laker possession. 15-minute mark approaching. Down two goals in a heck of a hard-fought contest. Come on, Meg. The two fastest kids on the field, I think, number two. Yes. And that's Julia Mara for Inner Lakes and Megan Materia for Plymouth. A little scrum down there. Megan gets it and goes it. with and it. Off she goes. Oh, no. She passes it up. Oh, no. All right, Lily, stay with it. All right. Liliana. There we go. We're playing D. We're Three. pressuring them. I like it. <clears throat> it's all about possession. Got to get the ball back. Nice hustle, Laurel. Stay with her. Stay with her. Oh, come on. I don't know what that call was. <clears throat> Elise Stewart, number six with the ball. Looking to set something up. Being patient. Chloe with good defense down there. There's good right, defense. Good D. Tibbs has got it. Megan, good. Look at her go. Taking off. Oh, look, look at number two, two catcher. Number two. Holy mackerel, she's got wheels. That was good hustle by her. Come on, Brooke, get there. All right, Maggie's there. Picks up the loose ball over to Barrick. Barrick Take with a, a shot. Ah, oh, little wide goalie's there to make the save. Brunt pestering the goalie. Oh, a little errant clear. We got to get there. Scoop it up. That's still in. There we go. Juno Sargent gets it. Passes it over. Wingstead. We clear it out. Back to Sargent. All right, white possession. Whistle on the field. Not sure what it was for. Get it. Number L with the intercepted pass. Very dangerous when she has the ball. And we're just swarming to defense on Katie Valley. It's a good tactic by the Bobcats. You have to stay in front of that. That kid is dangerous. I think she's got five, six goals, right? I think you're right. Yeah, six maybe. Yeah, six she is. Eight. She is uh, the offensive threat on that team. They are tough. She gets a free shot here. What oh, a great there's block. Noise with a nice save. Scoops it up to Anna Perliano. Avery Noise has stepped right, it up Anna, this half. Slow it down. Here we go. Playing very well. Nice pass up to Claire Eccleston. Claire up to Aubrey Brunt. Oh, Aubrey can't handle it. Doggone possession is tough. Good Makes good all the difference. Number four. It was a good hustle. All right, bad pass, though. We'll take that. Claire Eccleston gets it going again for the Bobcats. Take it in, Laurel. All right, Laurel Mason, senior captain. He's going right at it. Last goal we scored was hers. <laughs> going to look for another one here. Oh, nice check. Nope, it wasn't nice, I guess. <laughs> All right, Laurel. Approaching the uh, 11 and a half minutes left. Down two. This is still anybody's game, Todd. You got that right. Back to Brooke. Brooke's looking for Brunt. Nice there it pass. is. Oh, again. Oh, kick it in. Long clear. Those are tough. Tiff's fighting for it. Can't scoop it. We get it. White ball. I don't know what that call. Tips takes off. I don't think you can drag it back to yourself. Drag oh, it number eight. Drag it back is probably not the correct term, but wants defense. I hear that from the coach. Yeah, we're playing D. Get up there. Well, defense is keeping us in this, Paul. The first couple minutes we talked about it was three zero. Since then. No, I agree. All right, we're up to Mackie Welch. Here Come goes on, Mackie. Mackie. Watch behind you. 
Nice, she gets by him, that lefty. Mackey maintaining good control here. Mackey, well, it's a crowd favorite. You can hear the crowd get a little louder every time God, she gets the ball. Exciting. White, Here we go. It's off black. We'll take it. Anna Prilliano. All right, Anna, bring it in. Great senior captain looking for an opening. Nice. What a pass. Oh, get it, get it. Oh, oh what a nice great idea. Try, try to Claire. bounce it in. Oh, that was a good play. It was a great pass from Aprilliano to Eccleston. Too much e mustard on that. Eccleston just bounced it a little too hard. All right, we still got possession, though, Paul. Anya Barrick, she's a good athlete. Nice shot. Oh, right into the fishnet <laughs> of that goalie. goalie. right there. Megan's there, though. There's a the defense. <clears throat> Come on, Bob Mac. Make it pay off. Bobcats are hustling today, Paul. No, they're playing hard. They are. Oh, all right. Roper with a screen. Block, uh, no good. A little move. She was moving a little too much. I guess so. She had the right idea. All right. Possession goes back to the Lakers here. We got nine minutes to go, Paul. 8-6 Lakers. Here goes Maggie hustling back. It's a heck of a game. Anna, nice. Oh. Anna had it. Lost it. Ropes got it. Keep it, Ropes. Scoop through it. There we go. She's going to go right to it. That was a hack. Number eight, Katie Belly trying to get the ball back. Maggie Roper with possession here. Come on, Maggie. Throw it in. What a nice pass. Ooh. I think we get one of those eight-meter freebies. No, nope, it's their ball. I think. Nope. It is our ball. Yep. Aubrey Brunt's going to start with it. Here we go. All right. Travel? False start? What is that? <laughs> I don't know. Now it's black possession. <laughs> I don't know. We lost possession on that. That hurt. Approaching eight minutes. Down two. Anybody's game. They're playing so well right now. Hustling on defense. All right, Brooke Here's comes up with it. another steal. Here we go, Peter. Just Peter. Austin down the sideline. Gets hit. Still have it. Prilliano going in there. Get a shot off here, Anna. Looks like nice it. Nice move. Oh, and a nice save again by this goalie Haley is showing Dota. up. She is doing. This, yeah, she has showed up today. Look All at right. that catch. Clear it up to number eight. Over to number two. Ooh. A little aggressive there, Meg. Yeah, it just nice ran her over. Up. Tibbs is 100%. She's all in when she's playing. Soccer, lacrosse, doesn't matter. One of the top swimmers in the state. That's true. There's good defense down there now. Yeah, seven minutes to go, Paul. We've got to keep playing good D. One-on-one -on -one right there. Never got the shot off. Tibbs pushing number two. Number two, we've seen her speed. Yeah, she is fast. Avery Noyes has had a good day. She has. She's made some she great saves. She has been playing so well. Maya Wingstead tumbles there. Juno Sargent had it and lost it. Lakers on the offense again. Ooh. That's Tiff's. <laughs> Megan McTivier. As tough as they come. Yellow card. A little too aggressive. <clears throat> that was a collision. Yeah. And uh, unintentional, but it doesn't matter. Knocked her down. Elsie Stewart looks okay. Play a man. They're going to have possession. We're a man They'll down. Play a girl down here for a few minutes. I'm not sure how long. All right, number six here with the ball. Stewart. Noise again. Another blocks it. Good job, Avery. My goodness. Just outstanding. Is Maya Wingstead. Maya coming out of the pack. Good job. Nice Over pass to Mackie. up to Mackie Welch. Mackie going to come down. Welch to Brunt. Pick it up. Oh, doggone possession. It's killing us. 
Aubrey stealing it back. She's trying. Number four gets it up to number 16, Lola Ferrante. Mackie Welch. Oh, that's it's out off black. Nice. It's going to be white ball. White ball. Five, 545 to go here, Paul. Still 8-6 Lakers. Claire with a pass over to back Ropes. Back and forth battle here. Roper. Tiger Roper going to take it over. No. Drops it. To, to Brooke. Austin's got it. Got to hold on. His pass was hit on the pass, so we still have it. All right, 5.30, that clock ticks. Yeah, the clock is ticking. That's your enemy right now. And Brooke has it. Going to come in and generate some offense and Over to rec Barrick. record time. Get one on this possession here, Paul. Five minutes to go, down by two. Back to Eccleston. We have to get a shot off. Eccleston we have to, to get Brunk. a shot. I want to see Brooke back there. Pass it into Eccleston again. Brooks going back. There Throw it in. Front. Nice punt. Nice try. Got it back. Back to Roper. Come on, Ropes. Maggie Roper. Is it back to Eccleston. Yeah, give it to Brooke. Eccleston come down the middle and get it back from Brooke. Over to Brunt. Good job, Aubrey. Oh. All right, 430. We got to yeah. get a couple shots here, Paul. Got to get one. Anya Barrick with the ball. Got to get a good one coming here. There's number eight again. What a great pass to number two. They're working their magic. Look at how fast this number two is. Mativia is back on the field, Paul. Another stop. Good job, Avery. Avery Noyes has been outstanding this whole second half. <laughs> oh, sneaky two. move. Nice move there coming around the back of the sneaky net. Sneaky move. That's number two, Julia Mara. You've seen her speed. There's a little finesse on that one. Makes it 9-6, Lakers. That was a great uh, score. Did that all by herself. All right, well, with 3.53 to go, it's 9-6 interleagues. Still time, plenty of time. We just have to get some shots. Claire's going to do the draw. See if we can get one today from number eight. Katie Velli. Barracks oh, there. On you. Scoop through it. Here we go. Here we go. The possession up to Brooke. Here we go, Brooke. Nice, nice pass. Oh, into Eccleston. Pick it up. Oral Mason's there to pick up oh, the loose ball. That was a three good third, play. That was a go. good idea by Brooke. Claire was right there and ready to fire. Fire! Yeah, you know, oh, that goalie, she makes this it look goalie. easy. She's just right there all the time. Yeah, that, that, Good job. Good job by her. Goalie's having a good day as well. McTivier fighting right to the end. Look at her. All right, three minutes to go, Paul. Down by three. Anya Barrick with the ball. Over to Eccleston. Take a Eccleston shot. Eccleston to Brunt. What a pass. Brunt. Oh, Oh, yeah. what a great play. Eccleston to Brunt. Freshman to freshman. This team has a future. They're not giving up here, Paul. They're still playing tough. Brunt's first goal of the day makes it 9-7 interlakes. Terrific look, terrific pass. Exactly three minutes to go. Freshman to freshman. They have got a bright future. Well, uh, Coach has got to be very encouraged. Well, waiting for this draw. I just got another update. It's 12-0 Bobcats down at interlakes, boys lacrosse. That sounds like it could be a win. That's a good one. They're on a good roll. Playing very well, the boys. Yeah, we got three minutes here in the girls' game. Down by two. Win this draw. Ball's up, number eight. <laughs> Katie Velli is there. <laughs> Katie Velli. <laughs> oh, it's a Velcro stick. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Is she going to get it? Penalty. Uh, is he going to get the freebie? All Eight right, meter Avery. mark. Avery stopped the last one. Avery's had a, had a great day today, Avery. A great day, yes. 
She's played really well all day, especially the second half. Oh, she beats her that time. Yeah. Makes it 10-7. 229 to go. I'm pretty sure Katie Vela could do that any day of the week against any goalie. I think that's seven seven goals for her today. Uh, at least six. Might be seven. But at any rate, 229 to go. 10 7. It's a heck of a game. You can score in a hurry in this game, Paul. We get possession, we can get down there and get back on the board. That goes, yeah, Claire and uh, Aubrey Brunt do that again. Got to go fast, though. Starts with possession. Chloe Bouchard. Going to try and get possession here from number eight, who's only gotten them all today. And... Come on, Anya. She's going to scoop another one. All right, we're going to play D. She gets rid of it up to number six. Claire's dogging her. Looking to get that ball back. Can't leave her alone. She's going to kill the clock, people. Two minutes to go. I know. you got to get on Winstead. her. Instead, Maya's on her. It's a nice move by... Can't see what number has the ball. I think it's number six. Elise Stewart. Elise Stewart. Is back next year with uh, Mara and back next year with Katie. They're going to be formidable. And the goalie. He's had a one. great day. Another nice save by Avery Noyce. Oh, gone Avery Noyce. Just fantastic. Good job, Avery. That's not a good pass, Avery. Oh, but Chloe Bouchard we'll get is it back. Tiz is fighting for it. Minute 30, all these uh, loose balls. We got it Clock's back. Clock's ticking. We're running out of clock here. Minute and a half. Come on, you guys. We're running out of daylight, as they say. Here goes Anna. Take off, Anna. Nice Go pass. Over. Nice catch. Aubrey Brunt Aubrey's taking go right off. to the net. She uh, is very fast as well. Try to scoop it in. Oh. Who's this Ellie no. means? Ellie mean got a got minute. It. Got a minute to go. Go right to the net, uh, Claire. Claire. Oh. Eight meter. Not sure. Shooting space, I guess. And they're gonna have an eight meter shot here. Claire Eccleston, a minute to go. And cut the deficit back to two. Look at Claire. He's all business. Here we go. We go, Claire. Score on her. Yes. Yes. Good job, Claire. That's Claire's second goal of the day. Makes it 10 8. One minute left. What a contest. One minute to go. These guys should play each other every week. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> no, it's really good. They really match up well. Avery Noyes had an outstanding day in goal. Some incredible stops, keeping her team in the game. All right, one minute. This is a big, big draw here. Chloe Bouchard's back in there to take it, Junior. Ball's up. Let's get it. Oh, how'd she do that with one hand <laughs> like that? <laughs> that Katie Valley. <laughs> yeah. So number three gets possession. Bad pass. Brooks there to break it up. Got to get that. Got to get that. Stay on her. 44 seconds. Elise Stewart passes over. 30 seconds and counting. Coach is going, fighting 20. right to the last second. They are. The Bobcats are hustling today, Paul. Yeah. They've had a great game. It's probably going to end in an interlegs victory here with 14 seconds to go. Yeah. But uh, Bobcats run it should, out. Be, should be proud of the way they played today. Avery Noise, as you mentioned, had a great day in goal. And uh, Bobcats are getting better <laughs> every, every time out. Megan McTivier runs over another player. One second to go. They're gonna Quite by accident, and she's going to just step back. At one second, they're just going to run this off. Plymouth played one of their best games today, I think, Todd. They sure did. Captain Anna Perliano with three goals. Eccleston with two. Roper, Mason, and Brun each with one. And uh, we mentioned it a few times. Avery Noyes getting better each day. And yeah. 
Uh, you can see the improvement in these girls over the course of the season so far. Yeah, they keep their head up. They're getting better every week. Good job by the coaching staff sticking with them, pushing them, getting the best out of every one of those. And these teams, uh, they're playing well together. They like each other. It's a good group. Can't wait to see the next game. Yeah, final year today, Inner Lakes 10, Plymouth 8. Great job, both teams. Uh, we'll be back here, Pemmy Baker TV, with lacrosse next Friday. Boys game against Campbell. Should be a great one. Should be epic. Well, thanks, Pemmy Baker TV and Andrew Fenn, Jonathan Picard. Fabulous afternoon. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.